Hi guys, I'm John, and this is What's It Like? And this is the blog about travel and experience. And today I'm in Santa Rosa in the Billy Baco complex, and I'm looking for Baloo. Since I've been in the Philippines, one thing that everybody's told me is that I have to try Baloo. And uh, what I actually wound up looking up Baloo on Wikipedia and learned a little bit about it, and they say that the Chinese brought it here to the Philippines in the 15th century. And what it actually is, is actually an egg that's been fertilized, it's usually a duck egg, and it's been fertilized and then allowed to grow for a certain number of days. And I guess the ideal balut is about 16 to 18 days. And you can definitely let me know in the comments what you think is ideal. And I know there's a balut vendor right around the corner, so that's where I'm going to try it today. And hopefully they've got good balut. I'm going to ask them how many days old it is and how to eat it because I've never ever had balut ever before. And guys, do me a favor, uh, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, and watch the commercial as it helps me out. So it's a super crowded area here. You definitely have to watch your step. And lots of traffic. Hey guys. <laughs> hey man. <laughs> Doing good, how you doing, sir? Awesome. Oh no, I'm looking for some balut today. Uh, there's a, I think there's a balut vendor around the corner. Thank you. coming up to the balut vendor right now and so I don't know anything about his balut if it's good or not or how old it is or anything but let's see. Hi there, uh, so do you sell balut? So what can you tell me about balut? <laughs> how many days old is it? Because like, uh, uh, I've never ever had balut ever in my life. Wow, oh, guys, look at that. I've never seen an egg like that. Take that off like that? Ah. Okay, now you just drink it? Ah. Some salt? Some bit of salt? Maybe some vinegar? Oh, look at this, guys. Got some good vinegar here. Down there. I guess that's right. Now you just drink this. Well, I've read about it. You're supposed to drink this, okay? Oh, it's good. It, Tastes like bird. Tastes like an egg. I've never tasted an egg quite like this one, but it has a nice taste. It's nice and warm, and it has a good taste. So I guess you just from here, you just peel it. And I definitely gotta show you guys this. Wow. Yeah. Do you guys uh? Do you do the balut yourself? Yeah, just eat it, okay? Yeah. Alright. It's good. I can't quite figure out what it tastes like, but it has a good taste. It's yummy, yes. Yeah. I have no idea what the body parts are of this. Right here it goes. There you go. Yummy, yes. Yeah. Actually good. Look at that guy. That's it right there. <laughs> that is it. Oh, a little salt. Okay. Okay. So this marker is like a little bit harder, but it's quite good, actually. This tastes like a hard-boiled egg. This is good. A little bit of vinegar. All right.
All right. Got my hands dirty, but it's good. I'm gonna finish it. I gotta finish it. All of it. Do I want some? Okay, guys, so that's going to be it for this one. And uh, remember that go ahead and get out, have some fun, try different things, even balut. That's one thing that everybody has told me in the Philippines I have to try is balut. And it is actually really good. It's a lot bigger than I thought it would be. It's really like an extra large. Hen egg, but it's really good and tasty. And so next time, guys, remember that God made you for a purpose, and He made you on purpose. God bless. All right. Okay. All right. Thank you. Come on, Lord.